Coming up. Finish him. What's going on my people? Thanks for tuning in to another South Ballers episode. We've got a great matchup for you guys. It's a game versus Kimaira FC, a team that we faced before in the past. So this is the return leg. Last time we faced them, we beat them 4-2 with Charlie scoring a hat-trick. So let's hope the ballers can replicate that performance. Without much further ado, let's get into the lineup. So Dom wasn't available this week. About to shout out Wagner, who I like to call Sunday League Allison, also because he's Brazilian as well. So it fits the narrative. The back four, we've got familiar faces. We've got Ben, Tunde, Jay, and Eunice. So we went for a 4 2 3 1 formation as we felt like it's been working quite well for us. And against this team, we thought this was the best formation to go with. The three CMs, we've got Ibs, Noah, and Shams. And the three attackers, we've got Charlie, Abu, and Mason. The subs list as well, looking stacked. We've got Brownie on there as well. The gaffer wanted to get a piece of the action. I don't blame him, man. Playing with the ballers is a dream come true for a lot of people. <laughs> Let's look at the league table real quick. So again, it's still a battle between us, AFC Bexley and Danson. I mean, Beacons are sort of catching up a little bit, especially because they've got quite a few games in hand. So this game and the next few games are going to be super important. And we're also going to need Danson and Bexley to drop points. Lads, on a serious note, yeah? It is, a it is going to be a hard game in the sense of the weather. They're going to want to get some revenge on us for beating them at their home game. You have to take this seriously. You have to take this as seriously as any other game. It's time to start sending out messages. I can't say it enough. It's, it's important today to win your battles. Yeah, when we get the ball, can we be positive? If we haven't got the ball, can we be hard to beat? Yeah? But what I do want is from the people who are starting to give their energy. I know you guys are on Ramadan as well. And if you're feeling drained or anything, just straight away tell me. We'll get you off. We can let you either just roll on, roll off for a reason, yeah? We need to get that done. <coughs> Today is as important as every other game now, yeah? Because people have started talking about us again, about this and that, or we've fallen off. I tell you what, the teams that have beaten us have deserved to beat us because they've been either well-worked goals or we've just not been good enough on things like set plays. Today is massive for you guys. We show up, we give you all the care, all the love, all the looking after, all the attention, all the training. It means nothing if you can't do it out on that pitch. And it's a good pitch. It's not terrible, yeah? Massive, massive improvements need to be done today. On corners, pick up early. When we're going for a corner, make sure that it's, you know, you get one on the keeper and the guys do the other bits that they're meant to do. Don't just stand there and hope the ball will come to you. Make a run. All right? Hands in. Hands in, hands in. Yeah, come on, miss. Yeah? Hey. Borders are free. One, two, three. Before we start the game, a quick shout out to our sponsors, Christoph Peckham. Trust me. You've got to try their food, especially the jerk chicken. Amazing stuff. South Ballers to the world. So we start the kickoff. First of all, we'd like to apologize for the raindrops on the screen. It was quite a rainy day, so it was hard dealing with that. Don't worry though, it goes away after a few minutes. Secondly, apologies for the delay in posting the video. We had some tech difficulties. I think AI and robots have their mind of their own these days. <laughs> They're revolting. So, great matchup between South Borders and Kimara FC. Like I said, the last time we faced these guys, we beat them 4 2. Charlie scored a hat trick. And Shams bagged the worldie as well. But I know they're going to be out for revenge, though. They're going to want to get redemption. So this game ain't going to be easy like that. But the Borders know this. And that's why we've got to play with top intensity. Good interception there from Charlie. He's got the ball on the wing now. He's got their fullback chasing him. But Charlie ain't bothered. He's like, brother, you know, match for me. He tried to get across into the box, but there was no one there. So the ball just went to the keeper. Kimara FC is trying to play out of the back. I think Man City he must have inspired them. But Charlie picks up the ball there. Good tackle from him. Oh, Shams tried to get the ball over the top to find Abu. But the ball was too heavy. We get a free kick. Charlie usually scores these. What's he going to do? Goes over the wall. Oh, but keeper had no trouble saving that. 
there wasn't much power in that shot. It was just more accuracy and placement. Not a bad attempt though. Good ball there from Wagner to find Ben. Ben finds Jay, who was quite high up the pitch and gives the ball to Charlie. Uh, Charlie does well to get past the first player. But they did well to intercept it and they passed the ball back to their keeper. Uh, keeper, this is dangerous. Oh, that was lovely from their keeper. Looking like Edison. I've got to say, well done. Oh, Shams gets the ball in front of their box, takes a shot. Oh, but it just goes wide. That was a great attempt. Just a bit more to the left and that was going in. Good bit of play between Eunice and Abu there. Back to Abu. Abu gives a 1-2 between him and Mason. But Abu couldn't get a return ball as the defender did well to clear it out. Good start from the ballers, I must say. They get a throw in now. Noah heads it down. I am proud of how far Noah has come when it comes to heading the ball. He actually goes for it now. Oh my days. Did you see that from Charlie? That is a violation of human rights. No, personally, I would sue. <laughs> so Kimaira is trying to string a few passes together. Oh my days. The centre back kind of misplaces that pass, but the fullback comes to the rescue. But like I've said several times, Abu is a Liverpool supporter. So that gig impressing is in his blood. Oh my days, Noah's got the ball. Edge of their box, tries to get a cock back and it does. Ball lands to Mason, but Mason couldn't get a shot. Tried to lay it off for Charlie, but Charlie's left footed. So the ball didn't land in the foot he wanted. That was a misplaced opportunity for the ballers. It's still nil-nil. And to be fair, Kamara hasn't really had much of a chance. <laughs> See what I mean? This is why I call Wagner Allison. That sweeper keeper. They get a throw in. Edge of our box. Ball lands in front of our box to take a shot. Wagner was there, near post to save that. There's no trouble for him. The fullback is running down. Shams is staying on him. He's doing quite well to get past Shams, but Shams put a tackle out. But that fullback is quite relentless. Still going. Until Eunice crushed his dream. And now Shams picks up the ball. He's got time and space. I love the way Shams just drops into the fence to pick up the ball. Moving like Mustridge. <laughs> Great ball over the top. But it was a bit too much and the keeper came out to save it. Another lovely pass there from Wagner to find Noah. who dropped into the pocket of space. Now Tunde has got the ball. Finds Jay. He was quite high up the pitch. I'm loving this from the ballers. Look at this positional play. We're passing and moving the ball around. This is excellent. This is what it is. This is what it means to be a baller. Lovely bit of one-two. Mason gets the ball, gives it to Charlie. Now Charlie's running onto it. And the ref calls for offside. The amount of times that we get these bogus offside calls against us. It's actually peak. Like, how is he offside there? Referee! Control the linesman, please. Definitely not offside. They get a throw in. Now half. Now they got the ball edge of the box. They get a cross in and they do. Oh my day. One excellent save there from Wagner. How did he get a free header? Come on, ballers. Can you switch on, please? We get a free kick. And Tunde takes it. Whips a ball into the middle of the park. What a lovely touch there from Shams. Or should I say Zinedine Shams? Abu tried to play that quickly to Eunice. But we couldn't really get the ball moving. Bruh. What kind of clearance was that from their number 11? Ball dropped to Ibs. He gave the ball to Abu. Abu's kind of crowded by the red players. So they didn't really have much options. But somehow Eunice gets onto the ball. Edge of the box gets a cross in. But one of their players does well to block it out. But the ball's still live. The ballers are still attacking. Abu slips. Trying to get a pass to Charlie, but he couldn't. Now they're attacking us. The counter is on. It's 1v1 between Tunde and their striker. Trying to get a through ball to their striker. Allison is out again. So I'm talking about, man. Lovely clearance there from Wagner. Perfect. Oh, another lovely Excellent. touch there from Mason. Oh my days, what a ball to find Abu. He's got time and space to drive into the box. But he decided to go for a cross first time. The Kimara players did well to get a clearance out. The ball went out for a throw in. They get a free kick here. Triple ball into the middle of the park where Eunice was there to intercept it. Now Mason's battling with their midfielder. Is he, he going to get the ball? He does get the ball. Look at that strength. That's what I'm talking about. Now he's got options. Gives the ball to Shams. Shams sees that Abu's making that run. Lovely pass from Shams to find Abu. Now Abu has got time and space to drive into the box. Just past the first player. Tried to get across to Shams. It wasn't a very good ball to be fair. And they managed to intercept it. Now they're trying to counter with a long ball over the top. But Tunde is there to deal with it. Gets a pass to Wagner. Wagner dealt with it. We interrupt this broadcast to let you guys know that we have a cup final game tomorrow. 
You should come down and support the team if you're available. It's going to be a great one. For more information, check the description box below. It has everything you need. Right, back to the game. The game has been fairly flat, to be fair. We haven't really created proper chances yet. Oh, look at that from Zinedine Shams. Man said, follow the leader, 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 follow the leader. Yo, my guy took track your player to a whole new level. How was my guy running behind Shams like that? <laughs> oh, dear. But yeah, it's been a bit flat, to be fair. We haven't really created high quality chances, I don't think. How to get the shot? Ooh, just goes over the bar. Get a corner kick here. Abel whips one into the box. Ibs gets ahead on it. Oh my days. What a save from their keeper. That deserves a round of applause. That was an amazing save. Great corner from Abu and great header from Ibs. But wow. That keeper deserves some accolades. Oh, good bit of footwork there from Charlie. Ball lands to Mason. Outside foot. Tried to get a pass to Abu, but it was intercepted by the defender. That would have been a quality pass if that made it. Now the borders are still in action. Jay has to go past their midfielder. And he does a good job as ball lands to Mason. Mason gives the ball to Noah. I love this football that the borders are playing. Just play the ball, recycle the ball. If it's not on, don't force it. Abu is trying to take on his player. Gets a cross to find Yunus. Ball lands to Yunus, takes his shot. Well, the ball's gone out wide. And then a corner kick. Abu whips on into the box. Ooh, Noah gets ahead on it. But it was a bit too much as the ball went over the bar. Honestly, seeing Noah head the ball gives me so much joy. Ball lands to Jay now. Oh, nice flick there from Abu to find Shams. Shams to Mason and Mason to Abu. That was excellent. Good play from the ballers. Abu takes a shot, but it gets blocked by their central defender. But well, the ballers still have the ball. Jay tried to get a cross in. Ball lands to Shams in front of their box. Shams takes a shot on his left foot, but it went over the bar. It went super wide. What, did you see that play from the ballers? This is what I want to see. Pop the ball around. You know, it's a wide pitch, so it means we can do that. You know, tire out the opponent, get them frustrated. They get a ball over the top somehow, but Tunde was there to deal with it. And it gets the ball to Jay. Jay has touched the ball quite a lot in this game. Oh, lovely pass there. From Eunice to find Ibs. We're going to make something of this though. As Mason's got the ball edge of their box, gives the ball to Noah. It's all a bit congested in front of their box. And it did well to get a clearance out. Now the ball lands to the outlet. Outlet striker. But it's him and Eunice. <laughs> he had to go past Eunice. <laughs> I like how he just gave up. After like a second, he was like, yeah, you know what? I ain't going to do this, man. But yeah, I think we've definitely dominated this game. Stats-wise, we've had more possession, better shots. They haven't really threatened us that much. Let's hear from Brownie on the halftime team talk. Right, lads, have a listen, have a look. Lads, good half. Okay, like I said before, if you can't win, don't get beat. And uh, great save. And that keeper made an absolute worldie. I, I, from where I see it was no, whoever was right in front. Lads, we need to, we need to do a few things better. So I'm just gonna show you, cause I ain't got the clothes, I'm gonna show you the bottle, water bottles. Okay, three water bottles, we've got three up top. This is what we're doing. The ball will be, there will be one in the midfield and we're doing this. <coughs> yeah, we know where the ball's being switched. So the ball will go here and you guys here are not getting over quick enough. We need to make sure that when the ball switches play, left and right go over quick enough. Yeah? That's all I need you guys to do. And the 16, he's off for five minutes. He's playing left back. And the number 10, who's their centre back, stop putting the ball down their throats. They win the headers, yeah? Play the ball on the floor. Run at them a little bit more. I think it's there. But we need to step up a little bit. We've had a scary moment. Yeah? All right? Anyone got anything to add? I think um, in the final third, we're doing well. It's just the weight of passes that was kind of killing us in that half. So I feel like just make like, the rain. be smart with the passes and then more time. We you, know it's a wet, you know it's a wet, wet pitch out there, yeah? All right. Anything to add, Sam? You're shaking your head a lot. No, it's just, yeah, the rain, I was, yeah. Yeah? yeah. Anyone else? Think, let's not be afraid to shoot, man. Like, let's just do it. Let's see what this keeper's about, innit? Exactly. All right, lads, the hands in. Massive half. Yeah? Boys. Somewhere in this group is a game changer. Let's go, boys. Somewhere in this group. Rems, 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 let's where you at? It, let's get it. Where you at? <laughs> it's always this guy. Let's go, let's go. Borders are free, one, two, three. Borders. Borders. Let's go, boys. Have a listen, have a look. That's Brownie's favorite phrase, I'm sure. So it's the second half. The Borders need to up the intensity now. The first Perfect. half, I mean, it wasn't a bad half but we didn't really put pressure on them. Oh, lovely ball there from Charlie to find Ibs. Ibs takes this shot and that goes in. 
Well, the ref said that's offside. This is the second time now. Let's look at that again, please. Charlie passes to Ibs. Look at where Ibs is, please. He runs onto the ball and he pulled offside. Like, that stuff baffles me. Honestly, man, like, it, it just ruins the game for everyone. The ballers are trying to play out of the back. Look at that. Composed. Love that. Ball from Tunde to find Yunus. Yunus wanted to find Ibs. But the ball got cut out. Now they played a bit of one two. The striker's on. Gets a through ball. Takes a shot. And that goes in. Oh, wow. Kamara has scored a goal. It's 1 0 to them. This is crazy. They haven't really had much chances. But I guess whatever chance they've had, we've just taken it. It's 1 0 to them. I mean, the game is still fairly early, to be fair. So a lot can still happen. But we definitely need to start being a, a lot more clinical. I just actually want to score now. I'm not trying to play pretty football in their box. When we get into good shooting position, <laughs> take a shot. Right, take a shot. Okay, it's much better. We get a corner kick. Charlie gets one into the box. The player did well to head it out. But Abu got the ball back into the box. <laughs> All done for Tunde. He's going to take a shot. He couldn't. Ball kind of ricocheted off his foot. And the keeper did well to save that. He tries to get across into the box. But they had too many defenders there. They were able to just intercept it. But the ball is still in front of their box now. Things are still happening. Good head there from Charlie. Fun champ. Champ takes the shot. Oh my day. That's probably the best chance that we've had. Apart from the corner kick in the first half. But that was a lovely set up there from Charlie. Oh my days. This striker's on again. Good interception there from Bagnum. <laughs> Charlie's moving like Harry Kane now. He's dropping in deep to pick up the ball. Oh my days. What a pass. That was magnificent. Abu took a shot, but the keeper did well to save that. But honestly, the highlight of that was that pass. Another Ibs takes a shot. Bruh, what was he aiming for? <laughs> so we have our first sub of the game as Abu comes off and Nick Bay comes on. One of our new signings. Let's see what he can do for us. Oh, good battling there from Ibs to get the ball. Goes past the first player. He's in a box now, takes a shot and that goes in. 1-1 one, one to South Ballers. Love that. I think he must have heard me. He must have heard my comment earlier. Said, nah, brother, it's not me gonna laugh at like that. Let me get that redemption. Oh, uh, look at that from Ibs. His first goal as well. Love that, love that. Just like that, we're back in the game. Now we can start to play our football again. We can stop panicking and just play our football. Good clearance there from Tunde into the middle of the park. Or ball lands to Mason. He gives the ball to Nigbe. Nigbe gets the ball over the top to Mason. What's Mason gonna do? Mason thinks he got fouled. But well, I don't think there was anything there. Ref made the right call. They managed to clear the ball and now they're on somehow. Kimara FC tries to get a pass to their player in front of our box. <laughs> but Ibs was like, let me get the ball out of here, mate. No nonsense. They get a free kick about 45 yards out. But bruh, <laughs> what was that? So we're playing out of the back here. Like I said, we're comfy now. Comfy in our own ends. Get me. Eunice gets the ball to Nigbe. He's making a run on the wing. Cuts it back. Tries to get across into the box. But Ibs couldn't really get a proper head on it. But I like what I see so far from Nigbe. He's had a, a good impact in the game so far. Tried to clear the ball out there. But Shams was there, luckily, to get that save. <laughs> what was that shot? <laughs> Yo. That was wild. The Mason's coming off. Romario is coming on, We're trying to freshen up our attack. As you already know, if we are to be title challengers, we need to win this game. We've dropped way too many points. Oh, look at that pressure there from Rems. Look at the strength. Listen, guys, if you want to have strength like that, you know what to do. Just subscribe to the channel. Lovely impacts there from Romario. Who's coming on as well as Noah goes up. Again, we wanted to freshen up the midfield a little bit. Oh, look at that from Charlie. Good footwork. Took a nice shot. The keeper was there to make two double saves. Oh my God, the ball hit the bar. The footballing gods are against us, it seems. What have we done to piss them off? Oh, well, that's one of Vu takes a shot. Good technique, but the ball went out wide. That's that Thiago kind of Kind of shot right there. Oh, lovely touch there from Shams. Get past that player. Oh, crosses into the box. Nekbe's there. Takes a shot. Love that. His first goal for the club. What a debut. But obviously, we got to mention that assist from Shams as well. That was quality. 
I think that was absolutely quality. So it's 2 1 to South Ballers. We are in control. But let's look at that again. That touch from Shams to go past that player. Looks into the box. Gets that cross in. Literally put it on a platter. The nigga. But 2 1 is not enough. We need to try to get more goals so we can secure this win. Oh, what a lovely ball over the top there. From Nigga to find Romario, but Romario couldn't get to it. But rather, the keeper did well to come out and save it. Now they get a throw in in our box. Charlie gets ahead on it. But the ball's not dead yet. They tried to get a shot. But Tunde and Jay were there to get that clearance. Lovely defending from the ballers there. I mean, you got to give it to Kimara. They're still fighting. They're still fighting. Which is good to see. Good interception there from Ibs. Ibs gives the ball to Shams. Shams tries to get the ball back to Ibs. Is Ibs going to get to it? And he couldn't and the keeper did well to come out. Their keeper has been a lifesaver for them. He's been excellent in this game. But give it to them, man. That's definitely their man of the match. Oh, Ibs misplaces his pass there. Now they spread the ball out wide and their fullback is chasing it. That was a good ball to be fair. But he's got Tunde staying on him. We've got other defenders in the box as well. But he realised that we had all their players covered. So he decided just to go for a shot and try his luck. We get a throw in in our half. Oh my days, look at that from Shams. <laughs> Zinedine in Shams. This guy needs to write a book and has to be a midfielder. Oh my days, lovely interception there from Negbe. Negbe's one on one with the defender. He goes past the defender now. This has to be a goal. Keep on trying to come out. Oh my days. <laughs> what a goal. What a goal. Two goals in his debut. That was excellent. Good finish as well. Composed. That's what I like to see. Whoever made that recruitment, you did a good job. You're getting a pay rise. Let's look at that again. There's one on one with their player. He went past him. That defender must have been fuming. But that is a finesse shot right there. R1 circle or R1 square for my Pro Evolution soccer fans. Oh, couldn't put a work there from Boot. Gives the ball to Charlie. Oh my days. You know you can be prosecuted for that. Oh, what a lovely ball. To find Negri as well. Negri is in a good position, but the ref calls for offside. This is the third time we've had. Bogus offside calls. Let's do that again. Charlie's got the ball. He releases it, gives it to Negbe. Look at how many players are playing him on side. Honestly, man, the linesmen need to be better. That was definitely not offside. It's a good thing we're winning. So the gaffer comes on. Gaffer wanted a bit of the action. He wanted to get some goals. He's coming in for Charlie. Charlie's had an excellent game. It was well deserved that he gets some rest. Wagner clears the ball out. The defender did well to intercept it. And the gaffer gets his first touch. But it was just a ball that ricocheted off his foot. Oh, good work right there from Nigbe to chase that guy down. Now there's two on him. But he's done well to hold on to the ball somehow. Now he's driving forward. Tries to get a ball over the top. Ball down to their striker somehow. Tunde staying on him. Still getting away from Tunde. Oh my days. Tunde got spun there. Luckily Shams was there to save the day. Now Romario's got the ball. He's going to do this guy. But he does him in. Oh, what a lovely Excellent. ball. What a lovely switch. To find the gaff and the gaff just lets it run. Oh my days. <laughs> they get a free kick and they take a short one. Spray the ball out wide. The fullback tries to get across into the box. But Wagner was there. Pull out one of our goals. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> that was too funny. To be fair, if he had a connection in that shot. That probably could have went in. But they get a ball over the top somehow. The striker's onto it, takes a shot. What a lovely save there from Wagner. The ball has just slept off for a second there. It's the 90th minute, it's 3 1. I think they were winning. But now, nah, like, you gotta play all the way to the end. Right until the ref blows the final whistle. The game's not over yet. I uh, can tell these guys are tired. Oh, Gaffer's getting more touches now. Kimara has the ball in midfield. He tried to spray out a wide. Good work right there from Jay. He gets elbowed in the face. It's the 90th minute though, the ref just needs to call it now. It's game over, it's 3 1. I called it. That's it. 3 1 to South Ballers. One goal from Ibs, two goals from Nigbe. It was debut. Actually, both players scored their first ever goals for the team today. I think the win was fairly comfortable for the Ballers, to be fair. So, man of the match goes to Nigbe. Had a mad impact in the game, scored two goals. It's a no brainer. And Shams is creeping up that assist table. Who was your man of the match? Comment down below. And remember, we've got a cup final game tomorrow at BCD Stadium. 
come through. It's going to be a great match. We'd love to see you all there supporting us. Uh, boys, well done today. Hey, listen, I did say I was going to lose my rag. We went 1-0 down like we did last time. We didn't lose faith. We kept the ability. Great goal from Ibs. Thank you. To get a bit. Aye. That first one, that first one, hey. That first one wasn't offside neither. Cheaters don't prosper. I'm telling you right now. If we had lost one nil, I would have lost my shit towards the referee and that liner. Because we, we'd have been cheated. And he still cheated after. What? Yeah? So, what you have to do today is think about next week when we're playing a team who are top of the league, yeah, they're in the semi final with us. And, and things might not go our way. But we have to continuously play through. Alright, it's hard out there, I get it. And if we're going to make changes, you need to tell me, alright? Because when you don't agree with my decisions and it goes against me, it's me who. It's me who it reflects on. Yeah, you're a team, but I am the bottom line. Well done today. Oi. Uh, where's Ossie? Ossie Two goals in your baby, yeah? Uh, well done. Special mention to Wagner as well. Wagner, Wagner well done. Yeah. Hey, hey, thank you. Hey. Thank you. Solid, 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 solid. Wait, 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 just gather in, gather in, gather in, gather in. Yes, yeah, yeah. You're here as well. Gather in, Mason, come on, mate. Come on, Mace, come on, Mace. Mason. Where are you then? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, it's hard, it is hard out there, yeah, but well done today. Listen, boys, it feels good when we, when we win. And to put a team on, I feel like we should have absolutely destroyed this, <laughs> yeah? But the goalkeeper is really good. Yeah, yeah. We need to be better next week though, we need to be proper running, yeah? Mm -hmm. Ballers on three, one, two, three! Ballers! Ballers.